All right, so the new plan is gonna be that uh, because I can't answer everyone's questions all the time and I can't constantly update people what's in stock, uh, we're gonna do a video once a week showing what we have here that's in stock so people know what we have instead of having to call us or message me all day long and us keeping having to run into the yard and take a look to see what we got or everyone asking me because all day long every two seconds it's ray this ray that so once a week now we're going to do a quick video and we have to do it once a week because unlike pretty much everyone else who you see on facebook selling jeep parts we have an intense turnover uh we probably go through six to seven jeeps every single day so besides a couple maybe like five or six jeeps uh our inventory is constantly constantly changing uh and there's a lot of stuff that no one ever gets to see that we have. Brand new 33s, uh, shitload of bumpers, and whatnot. So we're gonna go through a quick rundown now, weekly, of what is in stock. And that way, hopefully, we can cut down our workload some, and then also people can uh, get an idea of everything we have. So if they're interested in something, they can just message us. So right off the rip, we have right off the rip we have uh old cj5 hardtop looks like it's a uh, later year one by the pitch on the door uh so that's like a 76 to 82 hardtop with doors miscellaneous bumpers push guards uh the big things we don't really sell because they won't go in the mail um, that's another CJ uh, Whitco or Maya soft top um, That looks like also a lady year um, That's a, one of the J trucks right there That we're trying to not scrap because only he's got 30 something thousand miles on it and it uh, uh, Runs perfect we never have we have an endless supply of motors um those those uh we pretty much just any motor we have is usually we keep them if they're right around 100 and 120 140 is the max on a uh 4.0 and then if it's a 4.2 like i try to be around 120 so what we have that i just won't throw away and i'd rather sell is a J body, a J truck body, a four door JK body, uh, 07. This is a Wrangler tub that uh, looks, was, I believe it was on a CJ, I can't remember, but it's like a 92 to 95 YJ tub um, in really good shape. There's a 2003 Wrangler tub, doors, nose, in very good shape. Uh, up there i don't know if you can see it is a where is it up there above the fence is a wrangler tub that was on a cj it's the nose the windshield body everything we just unbolted up and stuck it up there that's good uh you might have saw a couple scrambler roll bars um and these are all the jeeps that are in line to get taken apart they will literally be gone in about two or three days with the exception of the, the full-size jeeps which i'm still not sure what i'm doing with we have here looks like a 92-ish four cylinder yj this is a 93 i don't even didn't even oh it's a 4.0 yj standard there is a 98 four cylinder tj standard this is a 97 98 zj uh just a junk jeep then behind that is another four cylinder tj standard this is a 91 yj 4.0 automatic with the plow obviously uh here's another tj um i'm gonna have to actually look in this one to see what year it is this one's a 97 97 tj just by the looks of it, I'd say it's a four-cylinder standard 98 XJ. Uh, 
with automatic. Oh, nope, it's a 97. 97 automatic XJ. Uh, this one is a 1989 88. 88. Uh, YJ. 88 or 89 six on the YJ. It's an automatic. That is a 2005 or 6 TJ. Uh, Four-cylinder, standard, with a good motor, but that's going to someone named Mike Medeiros, I believe. This is a... I have to look at it, get closer. This is a 91 YJ four-cylinder, standard. That's uh, hopefully coming apart today. Uh, this is a 97, 98, 98 TJ Sahara 4.0 automatic. Uh, that is a, I don't even know, that looks like a 98, 99 TJ. It's got a Clayton long arm kit in it. Brand new 33s, uh, push bumper or brush bumper or whatever you want to call it with the winch, winch bumper. Uh, we don't know how good the frame is yet. We haven't looked at it. It was a rollover. This is another TJ 90. This is, oh no, this is like a 2000, 2001 TJ. I'd have to actually get closer. 4.0 standard uh, with a budget lift kit in it. That's a 97, 98 four cylinder automatic, I think. Or it could be a standard. I'd have to actually open the hood. Uh, let's take a look. Four cylinder standard, uh, 97, 98 ish 97 uh tj with the hard top so yeah we got hard tops we got doors obviously this is another tj this one i might have to look go look closer um this is probably a 99 or 2000 tj uh 4.0 i believe it's a standard i'd have to go look it's hard to tell if it's a standard or, or automatic just by looking, but this is an automatic. Unless you go look inside, obviously. This is a 79, 8, 78, I would say, CJ. There's not much to it to go by, but nope, 77, 78. This is a 78 CJ, uh, six-cylinder. I believe it's an automatic quadra crap. This here is a 94, 93, 92 or 93. I don't even know if it's a four cylinder or six cylinder. Looks like a six. Nope, four cylinder standard. Nope, yep, four cylinder standard YJ. Here's another TJ. Uh, sometimes when they're all beat up like this, it's hard to tell the year, but I'm going to say it's a 97 or 98 six cylinder. I don't even know if this thing's an automatic or a standard. Oh, yep. So it was a six cylinder. It looks like, uh, a 98, uh, 97, 98 standard. That's Sam. Uh, this is a, it's <laughs> no color, so it's hard to tell. Uh, this is a, what year is this thing? This is a 91 and down. I might have to open the hood and see what this thing is, because I don't, it looks like a four cylinder. Just smells like a four cylinder. Nope, it's a six cylinder. Automatic? I don't even know I had this Jeep. Nope, it's a six cylinder standard. Uh, YJ. Uh, I'd say it's uh, 91. Okay, message for me on the hood, 91. That's the customers who's still waiting to get for him to come look at it named Tony. Tony, your Jeep is done. Please come get it. This is uh, another J truck, uh, J10. 86 this one's coming apart probably that's the fc that's staying here for a while um so those are all the jeeps that are going to come apart and unlike other people who uh 
take a picture of the same busted up his jeeps. Here's gas monkey coming in. <laughs> Richie! Hey, what's, what's up? Uh, this is so we don't know if this one's coming apart. 97, 98. ZJ, they did a nice job cutting the back. They did a horrible job putting the lift kit in it. We're thinking about throwing it on the road because we're bored. That's like a 68, 69 J2000. We bought just for a couple of pieces to fix our little mining truck. So all those are all the trucks that are coming apart uh, fairly quickly. By this time next week, it'll be a whole new batch. That's been around for a while. That's a CJ8 body. There was one under the trailer. We're giving away this body for free that I'm walking to, but on the way there, there's a good diesel motor out of a Liberty that people like to put in DJs. Uh, you name it, plows, that's not even a part of the collection of plows we have. This is a fiberglass tub from a CJ. We put a crack in it here and there, but it's actually still pretty good. I'm just giving it away for free if someone wants it. This is a J20 uh, on uh, some kind of lift kit. I don't know what brand. It's got the high knuckle steering also on it, so it's up there a good six inches. Above that is a TJ frame with 588s. Uh, it's got a box lock rear end, Dana 44. Um, the, it's not that bad. It's been repaired, so we're just hanging on to it for now because it's just with the uh, lockers. Uh, who knows what we're going to do with it. We also got multiple J10. All right, so this is what else is left that's going today. Um, I don't even know what year this thing is. <sighs> 99, 2000, 99. Uh, automatic, I believe. 2000. I'm gonna have to open the hood and take a peek. So at least a 2000. So uh, it's a 2001 uh, 4 0 automatic TJ. Oh, hoods are free too. If you need a hood, just come get it. This one's a uh, YJ four cylinder 92 to 95, 94 ish. Uh, and this is another Cherokee, probably like a 97, 98 that's coming apart. That one's coming apart. This one, uh, Mark up in Mass, really liked the grill. So he's getting the grill. So I'm put a lot of work in that grill. I don't know if you can see it. Kind of cool. Uh, so that's coming apart. Then this is, is how, this is how they leave here, basically. This one's done. Garbage inside. See you later. So that's that. We're finishing up the frame, grabbing the gears, getting rid of that. This one's gone. 405 speed uh, Wrangler, probably like a 93. Then we also have millions of axles, pretty much any kind you want. Like people say they have trannies, but like that's just one of many piles of trannies we have. Uh, also, if anyone's looking for lift kits, here's the front half of a long arm from an XJ. Here's a complete XJ uh, with the short arms. And there's another complete XJ with short arms. We got lift kits just lying around everywhere just because we don't have time to, to list them all. There's Richard from Gas Monkey Garage. <laughs> Someday he's going to come down and do another episode with us. Uh, there's our new conveyor belt going up. Always have columns. So just to give you an idea, uh, when people say, yeah, they got an AX-15 tranny or they got an AX-5 tranny, like we have trannies. And then we take everyone apart and go through it, staring, more staring. So that's basically for a quick inventory.